So now let's begin the code part. So uh, I will create a folder in here. I'll give it a name of let's say server, right? And I will open the server in here. I will be typing cmd to open the terminal in this server directory. Now first command which we will be typing is npm init to initialize our server. So this will ask for different stuff. So server is okay. Press enter, 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 and everything default is okay. So now the package.json is created in here, right? Okay. So what I will do, I will open this VS code in this particular directory. For that, I can type code dot to open VS code in this directory. Okay, so here is my VS code opened. And I will fit that to my screen size in here. Okay. So first we need to install the express. We will be making use of express. So first let's install the express package. So here I will be typing npm install insta install and the package name that is express and ins ins oh yeah i have made a typo ins ta double and i'll hit enter and now let's wait for a few seconds and let this package install and there we go so package is installed now so in here in package.json you can see in the dependencies this express is automatically added and you can see this node modules is also automatically created because express is inside this node modules, right? Express is a dependency and all the dependencies are inside this node modules. Okay. Yeah. So in here, I'll be creating a file. I'll give it a name of app.js. So this will be your entry file, right? So now let's uh, require express, right? So I'll make a constant variable constant. I'll give it a name of ex express and here I'll require re q u i r e require express like so and now we need to invoke that express so here i'll be making const const app and equal to express ex express and i will invoke it like so so now let's create a basic hello world program in node.js right so for that here i'll be making a get route right app dot get uh get and we will be uh, so user will be making a get request to let's say default route that is slash and now in here we can add a callback in here this will take a two arguments that is request and response and in here we will send a response to user let's say response dot send and we will send let's say user a hello world like so and now we need to listen on a specific port right so server will be running on a specific port so we need to provide that port so here let's create a constant and i will give it a name of port in capital letters so let's define the port here maybe 5000 right okay now in here we need to write app dot listen l i listen and here we need to provide port so yeah this one and again uh, it will fire a callback function right so in here we can simply make a console.log console.log that server is running on and I will put a comma and the port number right okay so in order to run this file right so in order to run this file in this terminal what we need to type is node and the name of the file that is app now here we need not to write this app.js but just we will be writing this app and it will work right i will hit enter here you can see servers running on 5000 so now i'll open my browser and i will type here localhost l o c a l h o s t localhost local h o s t colon 5000 and i will hit enter here you can see hello world is being printed so let me explain your code again once again right what is being happened in here so the user is making a get request on this slash out and as a response we are sending a just a hello world in here and we need to listen a server on a specific port so we are providing a specific port and here we have added a callback function right when server will start listening on this port this callback function will get fire and here we are just making a console.log right so here we can see this log on our console in here okay so this is the basically hello world program in node.js right now let's say if i change this uh, slash out to let's say slash home right so what i have done i have changed this code part so what i need to do i need to kill my server control c to kill the server you can press control c so server is dropped now again we need to restart our server because we have made a change in our code file so if i here 
do a refresh here it here you can see we are getting an error that is cannot get because now we haven't uh, made here a code so we haven't uh, made any code on this node just uh, to say that how to handle this slash route right the default route so what i will do i will here make a get request on this slash home instead now here you can see hello world is being printed right so we haven't made a route handler to handle this simple slash request that was that is why we were getting error right if i again will save this and i will again need to restart my server right here i'll again type node app and again if i make a request on this slash again we are getting a hello world right so we need to make a request handler right for every route right okay so this was the basic hello world program in node.js so we will continue in our next video